Hi everyone, welcome back. My name's Claire. I've just done the most amazing sunrise. Um, absolutely loved it. It's bright colours. Um, it's a swipe. Um, it's circular swipe. Absolutely love it. I'll link that video for that painting in the description of this video for you. I've got leftover paints from that pour. So if you want to see what paints I'm about to use, watch that video or click on the link. Uh, I've listed all the paints. I'm not going to go through that again now. Um, so I'm going to do something very similar, but instead of an off-center circle, an off-center sun, I'm going to do a central sun and I'm going to do a circular spiral swipe around the edge to blend all the beautiful sunset colors. So very similar, but totally different composition, um, different canvas size, it's 30 by 30. Um, so I'm so excited to get started. So as I said, it's a 30 centimetre square canvas. I've put it onto my cake turntable. I've drawn um, seven lines. So I've got, I think it's seven or eight spaces. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven spaces. Um, and then I've just written on here, this writing is just to give me a guide of what colours I'm putting on, on where. So in the centre, I'm going to have the sun. So that's going to be white and yellow. This band is yellow and orange, orange and red, red and, per red and pink pink and purple, purple and blue, and then blue around the edge. So it's a very, very rough guide to help me to know where to exactly what to where to put the paints. So I'm going to just drizzle the paint on. I don't want too much paint because I won't be tilting it. So the paint will basically stay on. Some will be swiped around, swiped off, but not, to be honest, not that much. So I'm just gonna drizzle the colors on and then I'm going to dab it all with my finger just to fill in the bare bald patches of canvas. So this paint, it's it's my it's Dutch pour recipe ingredients, but it's not Dutch pour consistency because I've added less um, water to this. I wanted it to be a bit thicker, and the reason for that is if it's a bit thicker, it's going to hold the cells and the lacing a lot better. I've done it before and I've just used Dutch pour paints and to start with it looked absolutely fine but then as it dried the it was just too swampy it was just too runny and all the colours just merged into each other so you to I totally lost the the definition and the shape of the lacing so it just needs to be thick enough to hold it. Um, the idea of this is it's going to be a graduation of colours. So it's going to start off bright white in, um, and yellow in the centre and it's just going to get darker towards the edge. So it's going to be a real graduation. Hopefully the other one was a real blend. Right, so now I'm on to orange and red. Um, and the reason I'm doing it all um, over the place like this is because with each swipe, but then I'll pick up lots of bits of each colour. If I did circles of the paints, I would get rings and I don't really want rings of colour within each swipe. I want it to be quite choppy and irregular and a bit, a, just a better mixture.
Right, so most of most of the canvas is covered, but there's just lots of little gaps. So I'm just going to dab it. This will just help the colours to blend a little bit, but just most importantly, just make sure the entire canvas is covered so that when I swipe, it shouldn't get stuck, it shouldn't drag, it should just glide ev nice and smoothly over the whole canvas. Right, that's all my colours down. So I'm now going to start swiping. So I'm just putting a little bit of my cell activator down on my worktop here. Cell activator is Australian Floatrol three parts and Amsterdam white paint one part. So in this little pot, I mixed up 60 grams of Australian Floatrol and um, 20 grams of Amsterdam white paint. So I've got a little piece of flimsy plastic here, which I'm going to swipe with. So I'm just putting the end of the swiper into the Floatrol, into the cell activator. I'm going to put that in the centre. And then I'm going to keep it still and I'm going to turn the, the canvas. Right, every so often I'm going to be lifting the swiper off um, and getting some more flower troll on there, some more cell activator on there. So I can get some really pretty cells and lacing. And now I'm just going to go outwards very slightly. I am so happy. It's gorgeous. It's got such almost depth. I think it looks like it's, I don't know, I'm not sure that it really looks like the sun and the sunset, but because it really looks like it goes down into the centre. So it comes up. I, I don't know. Like the opposite to a black hole, a really light hole. Um, the cells and the lacing are beautiful. So happy with this. I just love the warmth to these colours. I like the fact that it's a rainbow minus the greens um, and it's a graduation and the colours just are so warm. Um, yeah, you've got that real sense of heat and of energy in the centre and then it just drifts into these other colours. The blue lacing is my favourite, I guess because there's the most contrast between the blue and the white cell activator. I like using white cell activator because white, I feel, just brightens everything. It would look quite, I think it would look quite good in a dark, in black activator, having said that. But I, yeah, I like the white. Just look at those colours. Oh, trying to get closer to help you to see it, but it's just going out of focus. So pretty. I am so excited by this. So I'll be back when it's dry. So this is now dry and I actually prefer this to the other one. I think because it's symmetrical um, and you've got all these little staggered swipes all the way around, I think it works better. Um, I love it. It's definitely, it's just so bright in the centre and it just gives the impression of being drawn in to that centre so that the centre is set back and the surrounding is out towards me. Um, the lacing is just beautiful. I love it. I love the graduation of the colours. Um, just the, here you've got blues and pinks and purples, just my absolute favourite colours. 
in fact i say that about a lot of colors i've got a lot of favorites but they uh, yeah they just look absolutely gorgeous together um, i'm just so pleased with the graduation um, it just seems to blend um, really beautifully from yellow to blue um, so really pretty to see a rainbow but in a different order but without the green um, I'm leaving my edges. I haven't touched the edges. I could have painted the edges, um, but I think I'm just going to leave them because they just, it just, it, they work with the painting. Um, yeah, it's so pretty. So inspired by this idea. Um, I'm definitely going to try again though um, and try with a more continuous swipe. Um, I've got a few ideas on how I'm going to get a more continuous swipe so I don't have to keep stopping and re swiping. Um, yeah, but thank you so much for watching. Please give me a thumbs up if you like it. Leave me any comments, any thoughts you have. Um, take care. Bye.